new petition would give Albuquerque voters a say in whether the city should stop the controversial bus rapid transit project along Route 66. News 13's Lizay Mitri has details on the new push that the mayor says is just another attempt to delay the ART. Well, I think it should have been put up to the voters. People need to have a choice about what happens, especially to a historic landmark. After rowdy public meetings and a couple of lawsuits, now opponents to Albuquerque Rapid Transit want the voters to decide. People feel very passionately about Route 66. Donald Clayton says his petition would stop the use of federal funds that would destroy the character and historical significance of the old Route 66. Volunteers have until the end of next month to collect more than 14,000 signatures in an effort to put the issue on the November ballot. Despite the petition, the mayor says if a federal judge rules in favor of ART this month, he plans to resume work using federal money to put in dedicated bus lanes and build bus stations. And I think a lot of the opposition is trying to delay this because they know that if we delay it, delay it, that that federal funding will go away and there are hundreds of cities behind us lined up to get that. It won't come back. With the mayor determined to move forward, what would happen if after months of work it goes to voters and the majority wants to stop ART? City attorneys say it raises legal questions, but ultimately they believe it's too late that the city council already accepted the use of the federal funds and a citywide vote after the fact wouldn't make a difference. Clayton disagrees, but for now his focus is on collecting those signatures. Liz Amy Tree, KRQE News 13. A recent poll showed 56% of people surveyed in Albuquerque opposed the ART, 28% supported and 16% still don't know or don't care.